gang, what's up? Aaron right here, Kennedy and Looney. This is the bridge where my father jumped two years ago. Pretty rough, beautiful area. He chose a good spot. Everyone has an opinion about Canadian federal politics. <laughs> oh yeah. Hey gang, what's up? Aaron right here, Canadian Looney. We're gonna take a spin. We do have some things to talk about. Unfortunately, today is the second anniversary of my father's suicide. It was brutal, guys. It still is. Like, he was my best friend. He was my pal. And he was my father. He was a great man, a community leader. He had enough and he had to go, I guess. He jumped off a bridge. Pretty, pretty strange thing. Like, when I got the phone call, like, to tell me, um, again, I, I still can't believe it. It puts me into shock just thinking about it. I miss the old man. Um, he was my best friend. I'm not just saying that. Like, I talked to him every day. I knew he wasn't well. Um, he went to the hospital the day of his suicide to ask for help. They sent him away, said, you don't need help. He went right from the hospital, jumped off this bridge. Some system. People think that uh, we've forgotten about that. We have not. He went to the hospital, you sent him away. I live in this wonderful community where people do care about each other, but our systems are failing uh, our people. Anyways, I don't mean to get too heavy into it. Um, it is on my mind today. It's rough. Anyways, we're going to head to Boylston Park or go somewheres and discuss Canadian federal politics because that's what we do here on the channel. The old man would be uh, proud, I believe, of the things that we've accomplished here grew this little YouTube channel, built a community of people that care about each other, uh, want change, know that change is necessary. We've come a long way, proud of what we've done, um, proud of what I've done. I've got some moderators that help me out, support in the chat. Um, this community too like is, is pretty wonderful actually like thought people were gonna be a lot meaner to me and I get I get mean comments uh, sometimes infrequently though and we walk right through them who gives a shit about those uh, trolls you know like gotta have a little thicker skin to Be on YouTube to do to put yourself out there on any any media platform. I've got friends here that are on X, Cheers, Cryptomeria, Kenny Crow, What's Shaking Guys, and here on YouTube I've got friends here too, like my man Brent Parsons, What's Shaking Man. Anyways, uh, quick shout out just to my moderators, uh, Miss Sheila, Captain Kirk. We've got Mr. Pickles, my man. What is going on, dog? And Dime Bag Coins, man. Appreciate you guys uh, helping out, keeping everything uh, in line. Our audience is pretty great, though, right? Like, we don't have a lot of uh, issues with keeping things under control in the chat room. It's more a matter of making sure that everybody is welcomed and greeted and feels at home in our chat room pretty much the game right there. We need change in this country. People might mistake my channel as a conservative channel. It's a channel that represents, th that is seeking change and exposing the corruption of our current federal government, which there's a new scandal every day, guys. Every goddamn day there seems to be something else. On the lighter side, these liberals are such a mess that they're easy to make fun of and easy to laugh at. Like, it's not funny what's happening to our country. But while we are, 
while we're exposing what is going down, we can have some fun making light of these atrocious, corrupt, disgusting ministers. Like, they're so transparent. Canadians see right through you. Like, you're all just a bunch of corrupt liars, drank too much Kool-Aid, part of the liberal cult caucus, following the charismatic leader. Trudeau's got no charisma, guys. He's a phony piece of shit. Dragging us down. Anyhow, that's fine. That's fine. What are we gonna do? We're gonna expose them, guys. Show Canadians what is really happening. In question period, in the House of Commons, the press conferences, other media, these stupid liberals keep putting themselves in front of the camera, which is the last thing they should be doing. They should be hiding from the cameras. People, when they see you, hate you. You are all hateable, detestable pieces of shit. There's nothing worse than these cabinet ministers, Trudeau, all of their liberal insiders. We see them in the committees. We see them all the time. And they're disgusting. Whew. So apparent if you watch, right? Like, and there are a lot of people that are paying attention because the fallout of this Trudeau mess is palpable. Like everybody feels it in their day-to-day -day living. It's out of control. And Canadians are picking up on it. That's how I came to politics. I was like, why is my standard of living going down when it should be going up? Um, I used to work uh, in the government for almost 20 years. And that's no fun. We will get into trash in that company. A uh, bunch of bullies. I, I worked for a lipier, liquor distributor here in Nova Scotia, the liquor distributor. And it was 18 years of hell. The people that work there, there's a lot of nice people in the stores and there's a lot of uh, great staff, but at the upper level, the management level, the executive level, these motherfuckers are corrupt and skanky. Absolute pieces of shit. Here guys, we're, we're coming here. This is, this is the bridge where uh, my dad took his jump. We'll get all spun around here. I can't imagine the old man did this, but he did. I guess that's what they say. Let's go and take a look. Goodness gracious, guys. This bridge, though, we're going to check it out. Going to use the other camera. Gang, what's up? Aaron right here, Canadian Looney. So we are, uh, it's November 10th today. It's the second anniversary of my father's uh, death. He took a jump from this bridge. It's a beautiful area. Good spot, I guess, to, uh, you know, take a big plunge, I guess, if you're gonna go. Pretty whacked out, I think. Pretty nutty. But it happened. He was a cool guy too, my old man. My old man was a great guy. Community leader, municipal counselor. Um, he was an elementary school principal. Um, he was a school administrator most of his career. And we do have a special community here in Guysboro. Oh, not gonna lie guys. People might find it strange for me to come and visit this spot. I just miss my pal. I miss the old man. I wish that uh, he would have gotten the help that he needed. I knew he wasn't well. I didn't know he was gonna do that. But uh, the last couple years of COVID and uh, his health fell off a little bit, lost his hearing. Um, 
and he was a real social guy, so losing your hearing, devastating, right? Anyhow, you don't realize how big this river is until you're walking across the bridge. Um, I, I've been on this bridge before, but it's not an area where many people walk, actually. The view here is pretty incredible, though. Like, hopefully the camera's catching some of this. Everyone has an opinion about Canadian federal politics. <laughs> oh, yeah. just here uh, lamenting I suppose beautiful spot if you gotta go you gotta go I get it I miss my buddy though Gang, we're going to wrap up the video right there. Aaron, Kennedy, and Looney, like, share, subscribe, get notified. Come and join us for one of the live shows. We've got a great community of like-minded people that are just looking for change in our country. We've got lots of videos trying to learn about Kennedy and federal politics, share with you what it is I see, maybe some of my opinions. We're getting through it. Like, share, subscribe, get notified, check out the other videos. Thank you for watching this one. We'll catch you in the next one. Later, gang. the opportunity to take a look at this wonderful crowd. Um, as Joel said, everybody here has been touched by Dad, Miles McDonald, Mr. McDonald. Um, he was the best friend to so many people. Would he ever love to see y'all? Like, <laughs> nothing meant more to him than this community. He came here 47 years ago and helped build what we have here. What we have here now wasn't here before. There, there's many people that were with him on the journey. Yeah. Thank you all so much for coming. It is a lovely Saturday. Everybody travel safely. The golden rule, it's so important, and it is so important. Um, thank you all so much for coming. Um, he, he, would, he would love to see this, this crowd. I know that he would. Thank, thank you all again for coming. Everyone has an opinion about Canadian federal politics. Oh, 